Nestled within the glittering allure of cruise ships, there are a few disturbing secrets and harsh truths they don't often include in their glossy brochures. Fucation presents terrifying facts about cruise ships you should be aware of. Floating Morgues Among the many surprising facts about cruise ships, one that stands out is their preparation for the realities of life and death. Given the diverse demographic on board, particularly the appeal of longer cruises for retired people, it's an unfortunate reality that some passengers might pass away during a voyage, typically due to natural causes. As a result, cruise ships are equipped with morgues. Although it's a sobering thought, these facilities, typically able to accommodate two to three bodies, are an essential part of the ship's infrastructure. While it's a detail most cruise liners don't loudly publicize, being informed about this fact offers a more complete understanding of what lies beneath the surface of cruise ship vacations. Disease Outbreaks Cruise ships have a heightened risk of disease outbreaks. The close quarters, communal spaces, and high-touch surfaces make these vessels susceptible to rapid transmission of illnesses. We've all heard about the occasional norovirus outbreak that can sweep through a ship, causing gastrointestinal distress to hundreds of passengers. Remember, keeping up with good hygiene practices, such as regular hand washing, can help mitigate the risk. Environmental Impact Despite the seemingly idyllic appeal of a cruise vacation, there's yet another darker side to consider – their environmental impact. These floating cities generate a significant amount of waste and pollution. According to the environmental organization Friends of the Earth, a single cruise ship can produce up to 1 million gallons of sewage, much of which is treated and discharged into the sea. The burning of heavy fuel oil also results in harmful air pollution. This harsh reality can take a bit of the sparkle away from the dreamy notion of a sea vacation. Safety Concerns as with any form of travel, safety can be a concern on a cruise ship. While significant incidents are rare, the vastness of the ocean and the isolation of being at sea can amplify the consequences of an emergency. Fires, power failures, or even the potential for a ship to list or sink are concerns. While modern ships are equipped with lifeboats, life vests, and safety protocols, the thought can still be unsettling. Food and Water Quality Cruise ships are renowned for their expansive buffets and endless food options, but maintaining the quality and safety of food and water on a ship is a colossal task. Despite stringent health and safety measures, there's always the risk of foodborne illnesses due to improper storage, handling, or preparation. The Unthinkable the thought of a cruise ship sinking is enough to send chills down the spine. Images of the Titanic tragedy are likely to resurface. Yet it's easy to dismiss these as a consequence of past technological limitations. But a sobering look at more recent data brings this terrifying prospect into sharper focus. As reported by the New York Times in 2013, 16 cruise ships met their watery end between 1980 and 2012. These unfortunate vessels usually encountered rough waters, such as the treacherous Antarctic Ocean or belonged to smaller cruise lines. One of the deadliest sinkings took place in 1994 in the Baltic Sea, claiming the lives of 800 people. In more recent memory, the harrowing incident of the Costa Concordia in 2012 stands out. The Italian cruise ship struck rocks off of Giglio Island, resulting in the ship partially sinking and causing the tragic death of 32 people. Although the captain was subsequently found guilty of manslaughter in 2015, the incident still lingered as a stark reminder of the potential risks associated with cruising. But it's important to note that the complete sinking of a ship is a less frequent occurrence compared to ships running aground. According to cruise expert Ross Klein, 98 ships ran aground between 1972 and 2011, which is about two and a half ships a year. These instances typically pose less of a danger to passengers, but underscore the importance of sound navigation and operation practices on board. While this information might seem daunting, keep in mind these incidents, though deeply unfortunate, are the exception and not the rule. Lost at Sea a potential situation you might not anticipate while envisaging a leisurely cruise vacation is the possibility of being stranded. It's not a pleasant thought, but mechanical issues, rough weather, or other unexpected problems can indeed leave a cruise ship unable to proceed. A notable example occurred in March 2019 when over 1,300 passengers aboard the Viking Sky luxury cruise ship found themselves in a precarious position. Off the coast of Norway, engine troubles crippled the ship, leaving the passengers 
passengers and crew stranded at sea. In an operation fraught with challenges, over 400 people were rescued from the ship, with 28 needing hospital care. The cruise line responding to the incident stressed, quote, Throughout all of this, our first priority was for the safety and well-being of our passengers and our crew. Although these incidents are relatively rare, they serve as a reminder that, as with any mode of transportation, unexpected circumstances can arise. As always, the key is preparedness, ensuring you have contingency plans in place and familiarizing yourself with safety procedures on the ship. Plumbing Woes as glamorous as cruise ships can seem, they're not exempt from certain mundane issues. One such issue, which can quickly turn a dream vacation into a nightmare, revolves around the plumbing system, more specifically, the toilets. Due to the unique construction of cruise ships, their plumbing systems are quite different from what you'd find in a regular building on land. As a result, toilets on board these ships are more prone to malfunction, with overflowing being a common problem. The issue can be due to a range of factors, from a simple clog called caused by inappropriate items being flushed down to more complex mechanical problems with the ship's intricate plumbing system. Regardless of the cause, an overflowing toilet can be quite an inconvenience, leading to unpleasant smells, hygiene concerns, and sometimes even temporary cabin relocations. Cruise lines generally work swiftly to address these issues, with maintenance teams ready to tackle such problems. But passengers can also play their part by adhering to the guidelines provided regarding toilet use. The Cruise Log On the surface, cruise ship vacations appear to be a seamless blend of enjoyment and relaxation, a testament to the dedication and efficiency of the onboard crew. While their pleasant demeanor is a constant, there's a lot more that goes on behind the scenes than meets the eye. Given their role in ensuring passengers' comfort and happiness, crew members are often unable to voice all that they would like to. In lieu of this, cruise ships maintain a detailed log where crew members jot down everything that happens during the voyage. The breadth of these entries is vast, encompassing both significant incidents like a fire and the more mundane details such as offhand comments made by guests. Each notation serves a purpose. They act as an ongoing chronicle of the journey, ensuring the highest levels of accountability, safety, and continuous improvement. Without a trace while it might seem like a plot straight out of a suspense novel, mysterious disappearances do occur in the vast expanses of the ocean. Out at sea, surrounded by nothing but water and sky, the unexplained vanishing of passengers is a haunting reality that adds a somber undertone to the narrative of cruise vacations. Reportedly, about 165 people went missing from cruises between 1995 and 2011. Some speculate the actual count might be higher. These aren't just cases of people falling overboard, a troubling occurrence in itself, but instances where people seem to vanish without leaving any clues behind. Now it's time to hear from you. Have you ever encountered any unexpected situations on a cruise? Do you have any insights or tips that could benefit fellow cruisers? Let us know in the comments section below.